Hi there, my name is Jacinta from the Nutri Farm. And if you are new here, welcome to the farming channel, the Nutri Farm farming channel. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for clicking. And if you are the first time here, welcome to the farm. In today's video, we are going to top dress our maize. I ordered this fertilizer three days ago and it has arrived today. So you have to do the measuring. And just to confirm, it is the collect kgs confirmed. That was 25 kgs and perfectly measured. You have to measure everything due to the economy and to keep our mats. Just to know if we, we are just to know the cost of production and everything. Tell me why the economy is very high and i'm not using the subsidized fertilizer for my own reasons so I, I i decided to buy the top dresser and today we are going to be adding it in the farm yeah tell me why uh, i have to measure it for every part of the garden yeah tell me why i'm using my cup this cup i just finished <laughs> drinking tea with this cup and guess what i'm using the same same cup to measure the fertilizer and i know i'll wash it and i'm going to use it to drink tea again i've done th this so many times like using the gadgets that are near to me yeah the farmer in me that's it it look like cooked laced it has a yellowish color yeah hi there i have just taken a break from pouring the fertilizer and we are here in the nutri farm and today we are healing our maize like adding soil to our maize and also adding uh fertilizer that is going to help the fruit the fruiting in the fruiting stage yeah, i'm here in the farm and it's around eight that in the morning and uh, i have a helper who is helping me to heal up the maize so i'm just adding the fertilizer along the lines you see the maize look good but now it's, it's our time to prepare for the maize to remove the fruit so what you're doing we are going to add soil we are going to add soil on the maize and fertilizer to help the to help increase our yields and to double production. Right now, maize is I think maize is going for around five thousand per ninety kg, and we are farming this for our project to subsidize our project and also the the. The remaining fodder we are going to keep it as silage and we are going to bring in bringing and more before the end of the year yeah so let's continue with the healing up of the maize and also adding the fertilizer and stay tuned top dressing is additional adding nutrients to the plant helping them to finish strong it is usually done when the plant is actively growing. In our case, we had to wait for the maize to go up to above 45 centimeter. It is usually said to be on the knee high and top dressing is done to help the plant to finish strong. As you can see, our maize is almost about to remove fruits. And now it's time to prepare the, the the maize to finish strong. What you do, you supplement your maize at this stage. And this will enhance the growth of the plant, ensuring adequate nutrients. And it will actually contrib contribute to high yields. It is usually done at this stage for a purpose, like... You can't done when you can't do it when the plant are smaller, or you have to wait when the plant is actively growing. This is when top dressing is is done, simply because 
the plant is active and it is going to start feeding on the calcium, ammonium and nitrate very fast and it is quite a lot of nitrogen at this stage cause of high growth. In this case, top dressing is done and um, in our case you can see we are adding fertilizer along the maze along the maze it will also improve the soil health for a person who is using organic manure yeah like it will it will help to increase the soil health if you use organic manure and also you can use chicken manure since it contain a lot of nitrogen yeah and top dressing is very very important if you if you don't do top dressing your plant might not finish strong and the main goal is to for the plant to finish strong for us to experience a lot of harvest so top dressing is very very important very very important at this stage so that we are going to increase our harvest you know what i mean you know this part of the ladder i'm done with pulling the fertilizer so we are going to heal up the place until it's done i'm going to show you the outcome after The good thing is that you can see for yourself, like we are healing up the maze. We are adding up, like we are adding soil. After the addition of calcium ammonium nitrate, CAN, to our maze, the next thing go ahead and add soil to the maze. And this will help a lot when you do this in your farm. Most uh, healing up is done in tubers to help them to increase production. Productions is tubers like sweet potato, white potatoes, and tubers. Generally, healing up is not be done in tubers, but also you can do it in maize. And in, in in this case, it is going to support our maize to give it a good support, like. The maize is going to start very, very strong. The other thing, it is going to help in water retention. Like there is no, you know, in our case, we, are, we, are, we only depend on rain for farming. So every drop must be saved. So healing up your maize at this stage will help retain a lot of water. And the other thing, it will, we also, we also in this stage, we also have happen to remove any emerging weeds. You know what we did with our weed. We spread the herbicides that killed the weed and left the mist. I think you can check that video. It is the previous video. So, in this stage, we help to remove any emerging video. And also, this will also increase our production. Yeah, this will definitely increase our production. And you can see today we managed to do this whole part. And the other garden that we started with and tomorrow we are going to continue with that other part and you have some other part that you're going to top dress and heal up our maize. Yeah, hope you have learned a lot with maize farming. Maize farming is the easiest to me, like it is easily manageable and maize farming has never frustrated me. It hasn't just been it has never disappoint me and I have been doing it and have followed very very I have followed a certain routine look at me there oh my hair looks so bad and my stomach is protruding I'm starting to look like a married woman <laughs> are you doing <laughs> that is how the hair look <laughs> <laughs> that's not the point like we are talking about healing up our maze and you can see our maze <sighs> I can't now we are waiting for a playing and hoping that the lane will come 
this week or by the end of this week yeah this time it has not leaned a lot in this area i don't know why but we are hoping that the lean will come and the maize will finish strong 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 after top dressing you know after this we are headed to the honeymoon garden honeymoon i can't wait to take you for a garden tour that is when i usually take you for a garden tour during the honeymoon meaning there is we are not going to be doing any work we are just going to be doing garden tours just without any work and waiting to harvest after the honeymoon that that is when we prepare to harvest but light now that is where we are headed the only thing we are going to do to this myth is for the application and i'm going to make a detailed video video on folio application the last one of folio application and from there we head to garden honeymoon yeah and this so therapeutic like these are pluses that i have this is the third time that i'm farming maize the third or the fourth the fourth time yeah the fourth time and it has not frustrated me even one time but i, I have a very detailed timetable that i follow when farming and i'm going to share that with you so make sure you subscribe to our farming channel till next time bye bye